Good morning, Atherton. You're watching Atherton on Air. I'm your host, Amelia Barber. And I'm your host, Molly Jett. Here's what's trending. Students in the health sciences pathway got a hands-on experience on Wednesday. They learned about what goes on inside of an ambulance. What an awesome way to learn about the medical field. Speaking of the medical field, on Wednesday, Atherton hosted a Red Cross blood drive. We spoke with some students to learn why they decided to donate. So we have a blood drive here at Atherton each semester in the hopes that many students will participate in the blood drive and have a good experience volunteering and then will become lifelong blood donors um, because giving blood is an important thing to do for our community. Um, currently, the Red Cross relies on high school blood drives for about 20% of our nation's blood supply nationally, and because of the pandemic, uh, the blood supply is especially low right now. So high school drives are really important. So I do have, um, do know people that are in the hospital right now with COVID. You know, they have to have surgeries, they have to have procedures done. I also know, um, like my grandmother, she's had to have surgeries done uh, to treat her cancer. And having blood to donate to provide for those people who can't really make um, that much blood themselves uh, during their procedures is super important. Thank you to all the students who helped the community by donating blood. For the past couple of weeks, Atherton seniors have been getting their senior portraits photographed by Miss Rice. We talked to her about how to get a portrait before it's too late. So senior portraits, um, I'm trying to do most of them during first period, so you can still sign up on the Google form. I'm going to add some more first period dates for next week. Um, you can see some examples here on the back of the board. Um, you're going to come to room 125 for your senior portraits. It's right here, kind of in the front of the building, next to where all the TVs are for media arts, um, across from Mr. Stutz and Miss Aldridge, if you know where they are, um, in room 125. And then we'll go into the studio um, to take your senior portrait. Um, you'll fill out a form on the computer with your name, your achievements and awards you've received um, in any class, club, or sport over the past four years. And you'll also tell me any clubs or sports you've participated in and the years you've participated in them. Looking for something to do after school? Let's take a look at our hallway headlines. The archery team practices every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday from 2.30 to 4 in the cafeteria. Check outside of Mr. Hoagland's room to see if you qualify for NHS. Don't forget to check the TVs outside of the media arts classrooms for even more clubs. Now, let's take it out to the student parking lot and take a look at this week's Car of the Week. Hi, I'm Charlie. Uh, this is my ride. Uh, it's a 2005 Volvo V70. My friends call it the hearse. I get a bunch of stickers on the back uh, from different political campaigns. And I got Heine Brothers and uh, Carmichael's. I think I have a sticker on there that's like kind of faded that my uncle got when he went to Antarctica. So that's kind of cool. I've got a sticker for um, Charles Booker's campaign and I've got one for Shamika Parish Wright's campaign for mayor. I haven't cleaned my car in a while, so there's a lot of leaves in there. Um, and I'm going to keep them for the fall. Those are some awesome decorations, Charlie. Before we go, we want to show off some of your all's great Spirit Week outfits. Keep up the school spirit tonight and be sure to come out to the football game against North Bullet at 7 p.m. And that's all for today. <laughs> Keep, Keep it cool, Atherton! Atherton.